Hey guys, Libgary is back, and now this is kind of going to be a pretty good video, I should say, and I think it would be a really neat thing to do. So I know that it took me a ton of time to figure out how to install mods and stuff, but eventually I found this way. Now this is a video that I pretty much just sat down and started recording without any preparation at all, like right now, so... <laughs> Um, luckily, I do have this up, so this is what you want to go to. Basically, go to, just search up Koviax Mod Pack. There you go. And, yeah, it will show up what it is. I can never remember the spelling. It's so annoying. Anyway, what you should see is right here. Koviax Mod Pack. Choose your pack and adventure. And your adventure, sorry. Okay, so it's going to bring you to this page. The end. Tra -la 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 -la. Ha ha, JK. Now, you want to hit this button right, right here, the standard mod pack. Click it, and this works with both versions. Now, this has the current version, what it is, right here. And I don't care. So, <laughs> these show you all the mods it has. Although, of course, you can disable any if you don't want them. So I'm not going to go list through all of them, because that would take me forever, because they have updated a lot recently. So, what you want to do is, I have a Mac, so I'm, of course, going to click Mac. So, it's just going to say, Kovix Mod Pack Download. Now, you may be thinking, what? It's a mod pack. You get the mods that's in it. Done. Well, not exactly. So, when you hit Download Mod Pack, it should eventually pop up in my downloads. If it doesn't, which I've had happen before, just hit that and it will do it for you again just to demonstrate. There you go. Okay, so, so because I don't need it, one of those, I'm just going to cancel that and go to where here is and hit clear because I don't need all those files. There we go. Now I'm just going to minus out of that now, this right here is, um, this one right here is, um, or that's a weird video, but this is one that I'm editing and going to be posting soon, hopefully, if everything goes as planned. Now, you will get this folder that says Kovix Mod Pack. Now, because I already have one, which is the one that I have, I'm just going to rename that to two real quick so that I can show you this. Okay, so when you get the file, you are just going to double click it and you'll get this. Now this is the application. Now if you go into other stuff, you can see check for updates, which you'll want to hit um, maybe like every week or so, just to see if there are any new updates around. So if I extend this a little bit more, um, that's all the options. But yeah, you can double click, ah, what, what am I doing? You can just click those. <laughs> And they will um, bring you to the, where you want to be. So what happens when I hit this? Oh, I don't care. Um, let me just pause this for one second, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, sorry about that. That was just a glitch in the way it works. You know, control blocking things. Okay, so anyway... I just, um, just, you know, f did some things. It didn't take me very long. Like, I just, um, closed it out, opened something else, closed it again, and then opened this back up, and there we go. So, that probably won't happen to you, but it's not really important. Anyway, so you're going to get in this page. And you can go, and you can check off all of them. Now, if you, now, these are just the ones that come with it. Now, this is really simple. And you just check off the ones you want and hit, you hit continue. But to show you for demonstration purposes, I already have a mods folder that it creates manually. So what I'm going to simply do is I'm going to take my mods folder and I'm just going to drag it out there if it will work for me because my computer is being really annoying right now. Yay, it actually worked. What a surprise. So I'm actually just going to um, uncheck all of this stuff. Yeah. I wish it would say like check all or uncheck all because that would be 
like, really good. <laughs> but unfortunately, this mod pack isn't smart enough. Okay, never mind that. So, yeah, I'm getting down to all these bottom stuff now. I'm not, again, I'm not going to go over all the things, but don't do this, but you can actually install, um, the, um, morph mod and, um, simply hacks on it because this is 1.7.2, I'm pretty sure, or something around that. Anyway, I'm going to hit, can, um, let me just hit go back for one second and I will show off how about, um, mo furniture and that'll be pretty much good since that's a pretty good cool mod so it'll just so you'll just say continue and it will do this now this problem now if you watch this later on and this is not the update that you're looking for um I'm pretty sure that it's all the same now this is taking for okay there we go so it also require it downloads all the required files now I will also open it up show you what it is before like, before we add the custom mods and afterwards. Now, I can't guarantee that all the mods you put in there will work. Because some of the mods just don't work with it. It's probably because this uses Forge. So, if you don't have, um, it automatically installs Minecraft Forge. But, if you're using a mod that uses, um, the other one. I can't remember the other one. I never have and I never will. <laughs> but, if it's not Minecraft Forge, it probably won't work on this. And also, taking an example with the portal gun mod, you need to have all the extra stuff in it. If you this that won't automatically install this. I'm pretty sure that that has it in there if I remember correctly. But again, the point is when you're not using the ones that are already in the game, it's going to you're going to have to do some more things. So, So I'm just opening up my Minecraft here, and I will go, and as you can see, I already have this one, I have this one, and okay, so if I go to here, you can see, when I go to edit profile, you can see I have this and this. Now this is the old one I have, now if I hit this one, you, and I hit save profile, hit play, now we'll say launching. There we go. Now it's loading, and it normally does this. It will show the version name at the top. And here you go. Now we'll go if you. Oh. What am I doing? Okay, if you go into mods, we'll show what mods you have. And you can actually disable them. So then you can hit that. Config, there you go. So if I hit done, I'm going to go in here and I have a ton of single player worlds. Don't ask why, I just love it. So I'm going to go into here. I don't care. I really don't care. If it crashes, though, then I care. Yeah, it did. It, yeah, it crashed. Okay, that is just really annoying. <laughs> hey, then, I do care. You may have trouble. No, you don't say. How about you say it will have trouble? There's a difference. <sighs> Okay, I'm going back to what I was saying, I'll just quickly do what, where is my spelling today? And that should be good. I'll probably go, yeah, yeah, that's good. Okay, there we go. Now you're probably getting bored by the sound of my voice, so if you want, just mute. That's why there is a mute button. But I hope that this tutorial does help you. 
Okay, now, what's this? Oh, look what we have here. Now, me as a person, I have tried to do this mod and it has never worked. And look at Kobe's mod pack. Look how awesome that is. And look, I can even order stuff. It's called Mine Bay. Look. Bye, 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 bye. Oh, wait, I'll just give myself a boatload of diamonds. Here we go. Now let's go do 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 do. Buy myself nether stars. Now, if I'm sure. Oh, I've okay. Never mind. You do that. That's what you do. Okay. There we go. And then we'll do that. Isn't that awesome? So that's, I'm just going to, that's basically what it is. Now, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to quit the game and I'm going to show you what it did. So if I go and, um, yeah, there we go. So if you see, as you know, I moved my mods folder out. It, you should find it right here. There you go. Mods, and it will show you. Now what I am going to do is I'm going to... Take them. Take one of the mods that I already have in here. That um, actually have a place where I keep this. Okay, now let me put in the Pandora's box mod. Now, if now we'll also tell you if you have the wrong version. So if I just do that, and I open up Minecraft again. Loading play. Um, there we go. So now, if we go in, now if I chose the right version, oh no, I have 1.6, and as you know, f you know, for my modded survival, and I also have this. So we'll see if this is the right version. I'm pretty sure it is, but we'll sh we'll see. And there we go. Five mods loaded. Pandora's box. Let's go into this. Though, though the, the more mods you have, I will warn you, your game will lag, so I suggest putting an Optifine. So now, as you can see, it doesn't really add anything except Pandora's Box. There we go, you have the Pandora's Box mod, which is a really fun mod. No idea what's gonna do this time. Oh, that's cool. It's raining. S oh. Okay then. Okay. Oh, the, 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 the. I'm, I'm going to basically just create mayhem right now. Oh, jeez. What the? What am I doing? Why am I destroying the universe, Aiden? Stop. Stop destroying the universe. What am I doing? Oh no. I'm I'm destroying the universe. Oh no. Okay. There you go. There are floating flowers. I I I can I just completely destroyed the universe. There are birch trees growing on top of a giant lollipop. That's messed up. The, anyway, guys, so that is how you install mods the easy way. So I hope you enjoyed this mod review, or not, what, oh my gosh, I am so horrible at speaking today, excuse me, I've had a long day at school, anyway, thank you for watching this um, tutorial on how to install mods the easy way, so thank you, and I will see you guys next time. The end! Okay, now, actually, seriously, this is the end. Okay, now, go away, I don't want to see your face.